one. Stack layout can organize widgets with more complexity than box layout. Two. Box layout organizes widgets either horizontally or vertically. With stack layout, you can combine the orientations. There are four row-wise orientations, and there are four column-wise orientations. The four row-wise orientations are shown in the next few examples, along with one example of a column-wise orientation. 3. This is the main Python file, which we'll call a particular KV file. As in the box layout examples, we don't have a main KV file. 4. All KV files are of this format. There are a total of 9 buttons, each with the same size end, so 3 will fit in a column, and 3 will fit in a row. 5. This is the result for the orientation, LRTB. The buttons are added in left to right fashion, and secondly from top to bottom. 6. This is for the orientation, LRBT. First the widgets are added left to right, and then bottom to top. 7. This is for the orientation, RLBT. First the widgets are added right to left, and then bottom to top. 8. This is for the orientation, RLTB. First the widgets are added right to left, and then top to bottom. 9. So far, the examples were row-wise orientations. Now, there is an example of a column-wise orientation, such that bottom to top is first, and left to right is next. However, instead of button with text, B5, we have a widget. The widget class is the class that all widgets, such as buttons, are based on. 10. Because of the widget, B5 is replaced by an empty box. 11. You can find additional information including the source code at pythonmobile.blogspot.com.